In this video, we will learn about the function of the second operation mode on the G100. Second operation mode allows two different operation modes and allows the user to switch between them as required using the multifunction input terminal. When using the auto manual switch installed on the panel, the operation method needs to be changed and the operation method of the inverter is changed using a switch. Mode switching can be used to stop remote control during an operation and to switch operation mode to local control or to operate the inverter from another remote control location. This function can be applied when you want to directly operate the inverter in local control. By operating the switch connected to the inverter on the outside of the panel, the remote command is disabled and the inverter can be operated by the use of terminal block or keypad. The original operation method can be resumed by using the remote operation switch on the panel. To use the second operation mode, select one of the multifunction terminals and select it as the second source. Let's program the second operation using the multifunction terminal. Move to in-group and select one of number 65 to number 69 and set it to number 15 second operation function. In this video, we will set the second operation function to P5 terminal 69. Original operation is set in operation group DRV, FRQ, and setting of operation method is set in BA group 4 and 5. When the switch of P5 terminal is in the off state, it operates in the original operation state, which we set in DRV and FRQ. The frequency is displayed according to the voltage setting because the operation command in the original operation state is set to the terminal block and the frequency command is set to the 0 to 10 voltage. Since it is set as a voltage command, the frequency according to the voltage setting is displayed. If the switch of P5 terminal is changed to on state, it operates in the second operation state. The second operation state is operated by terminal block command source and 4 to 20 milliampere frequency command. The operating frequency varies according to the 4 to 20 milliampere current command. The second operation mode allows the user to switch between various command sources such as terminal block operation, keypad, and communication. Frequency reference source to voltage, current, keypad, communication, etc. If the second operation is terminal command, the operation will continue as the operation command is identical as the original operation and only the frequency source is changed. But, if the command source is also changed, the operation will be stopped. The operation will resume once the changed command source is enabled. Let's test it. Set the multifunction input terminal P5 as 15 second source and set the command source as the terminal block. The frequency reference source of the original operation will be set as 0 to 10 volts, and the frequency command of the second operation will be set to 4 to 20 milliamperes. In this case, adjust the voltage source to 2.5 for 14 Hz and set the current source to 12 milliamperes. Turn terminal P1 on to perform the operation. Terminal P5 is off, 
so you drive at the frequency of the basic operation 15 Hz. Switch terminal P5 on. Frequency command has changed to current, and operating speed will be changed to 30 Hz. Turn terminal P5 off again, and speed has changed to 15 Hz. We have learned second operation mode. Thank you.